This is Halliburton, Ontario. A stunning highland blanketed by beauty and carved by lakes. It is here where Matt Duchesne's passion for the game was born. Halliburton's a big time hockey town and obviously it gets really cold in the winter so we have a ton of lakes and they all freeze and there's a lot of pond hockey going on and uh, our town pretty much revolves around hockey. It was kind of in the blood and, and I fell in love with it at a very, very young age. Here he comes, swooping out here to the side, Duchesne scores! Back to Shane. A teenage standout, Matt joined the Brampton Battalion of the Ontario Hockey League and quickly grew into one of the top prospects on the planet, featuring a well-rounded two-way game. Playing in Brampton was definitely a, a blessing. Uh, they were two very memorable years and uh, really a lot of fun. Welcome to the Bell Centre for the 2009 National Hockey League Entry Draft. Nervous? I'm so nervous, I'm shaking. Entering the 2009 NHL Draft, Matt was projected to be a top pick and was eventually selected third overall by the Colorado Avalanche, the team he adored growing up. Thank you so much, eh? Are you all right? Thank you so much. Thank you. The draft was, was un, unreal. Joe Sackett called me that day and it was just amazing. It was just such a dream come true. Joe Sackett. For me, it was, uh, was you know, pretty special to be going to my favorite team as a kid. Matt would spend eight seasons in Colorado, scoring 178 goals, placing him 10th in franchise history. Goal! Matt Duchesne! During his time with the Avalanche, he was a key member of their young core and leadership group, and the city of Denver would shape his life. I had so many great teammates and older guys and guys I really looked up to as a kid that I got to play with. I met my wife my first year out there. Um, obviously, that's the biggest thing I took out of being in Colorado is, you know, my family. I wouldn't have who I have in my life without having been there. In 2014, Matt was selected to represent Canada at the Olympic Games and would help bring home a gold medal. I was stressed out. I was the youngest guy on the team. I think I was 22 or 23. You know, you go play for Team Canada, you're expected to win. You look around and you see the guys beside you and um, guys you're playing with on a line. And, you know, it's it, it's pretty surreal because you watch a lot of those guys growing up, right? Because I was still young. So felt really grateful to be on that team. That was such a big goal of mine to make that team that year and, and uh, one of the best moments of my life. Matt would suit up for the Senators, Blue Jackets, and Predators over the next seven seasons. In 2022, he would score 43 goals, the best offensive output of his career. It is Duchesne, he scores! In July, Matt signed a one-year deal with the Dallas Stars, joining a contender in his quest to reach the ultimate pinnacle in the sport. Fortunately enough for me, I've played long enough that the, the money side of things wasn't really a, a consideration was more about you know going somewhere where I had I felt like was a really good fit for me and, and a team that has been really competitive. He wanted to be here and and frankly took less to be here uh, to join our group so that shows you how badly he wants to win and how badly he wants to be a Dallas star. He's a highly skilled player, uh, he's got great speed, uh, great puck position. I think the most important thing is is his desire to win. With nearly 1,000 games played in the National Hockey League, Matt brings a wealth of experience to Dallas while providing leadership and an offensive dynamic. You know, I'm excited for Duchesne coming in here. When you play against a guy, you definitely have some respect for their skills and their talent level. You can tell he's hungry and he's passionate about the game and those things all add up. Now firmly settled into the Stars culture, Matt is solely focused on helping this team realize their full potential and reach the next level. You can feel the focus in this locker room and amongst the guys and, and how bad guys want it. And I, I love that because I'm, I'm right in the same boat. 